Hello pen pals! Today we're cooking up a fun hack to put new life in your Retro 51 Rollerball pen refills. In this video we're going to show you step by step how to refill your Tornado Rollerball cartridge to write with fountain pen ink. My name is Tom and I'm your chef, guiding you through this simple yet useful hack. If you're like me and love fountain pens for all of the ink colors that you could use with them, then you'll love this hack. Finally, you can have an option other than black or blue ink for your retro pen. Also, this is a great way to reuse spent cartridges to get more life out of it, generating less waste and saving money. So let's take a look at all the ingredients needed for this hack. You'll need a Retro 51 Rollerball refill, either the Ref 5P or Ref 57P. You'll need a pair of pliers. This is a Leatherman multi-tool, it's got pliers with it. You'll need a rubber band. You'll need a pipette or an eyedropper. You'll need a, a, a paper clip would work or I have uh, alligator pliers. And bottled ink, of course. This I have Earl Grey. And a paper towel, lastly. Something just to keep things clean. Step one, we have to remove the Retro 51 Tornado refill. Make sure to keep the spring um, either inside of the barrel when you remove it or inside of the little nose cone here. Remove the cartridge. Step two, using the pliers and the rubber band just to keep it from making teeth marks on the, the back end here, remove the back stopper plug here. There we go. Step three, use the unfolded paper clip or the alligator forceps and reach in to grab the sponge tube from the refill cartridge. Step four, Thoroughly clean the sponge tube under running tap water. Squeeze repeatedly and flush out all the remaining color until the tube is completely white. Step six, let the sponge tube and metal barrel dry on a paper towel to wick out the residual water. Dry the inside of the metal barrel with a paper towel. This I like to put in a cup so that you could point the refill tip down and it wicks out the rest of the inky water that's in there. Step seven, going to pick an ink. We have Diamine Earl Grey because we're going to fill it and put it in our Retro 51 Tornado London Skyline. Figure it's a good fit. Step eight, use an eyedropper or pipette to deposit ink into the open ends of the sponge. Gently pressing on the sponge to encourage full absorption. Make sure to fully saturate with a lot of ink. Okay, step nine, install the sponge back into the metal tube and replace the end cap. If the fit is loose, you can use a little bit of silicone grease to help create a more secure closure. You could try pushing it in just a little bit with either the alligator forceps there or the unfolded paper clip just to get it in position. It has to be in contact with the wick that's inside of the, the tube here. So we're gonna replace the end cap, press down, feels nice and tight. Now step 10, give the refill some time to fully saturate and make sure that ink is flowing. Then start scribbling. At first the ink may come out looking a bit darker as it mixes with the ink that may have been previously inside of the feed. After some scribbling, the refill should start looking like the ink color that you chose. All right, so I'm going to reinstall this cartridge. Now, now it's filled with Diamine Earl Grey back into the Retro 51 Tornado Rollerball London Skyline. 
The results may vary based on the ink used. If the ink is coming out inconsistent and light, then you may need to resaturate the sponge with more ink. If it floods out too much, then squeeze a bit of ink out of the sponge and make sure that the refill's plug cap is securely in place with silicone grease. And this is the Retro 51 Tornado Skyline Paris inked with Gerban Poissier de Lune, which I thought was a good fit for this pen since it's got like a lot of different purples in it. So we'd love to see what colors that you come up with in your retro tornado rollerball pens. Share your results on social media by tagging us at Goldspot Pens and use the hashtag Retro51Hack. Thanks to Penboy Roy for texting me about this hack at 3 a.m. in the morning. We hope that you found this hack a recipe for success in your writing endeavors. Give us a big old thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Hit the subscribe button to get more how-tos, unboxings, interviews, and pen-related fun videos. Thanks for tuning in, and stay inky, my friends. Take care.